Well, my dear students, the course is Labor Policy Pakistan and the topic is Section 31, 32 and 33 of the Factories Act, my dear students. Section 31 deals with casing of new machinery. Section 31, subsection 1, in all machinery driven by power and installed in any factory after the commencement of the Labor Laws Amendment Ordinance 1972, every set, screw, belt or key on any revolving shaft, spindle, wheel or pinion shall be so sunk, encased or otherwise effectively guarded as to prevent danger and all spur, worn and other toothed or Friction gearing which does not require frequent adjustment while in motion shall be completely encased unless it is so situated as to be as safe as it would be if it were completely encased. Subsection 2. Whoever sells or lets on hire or as agent of a seller or hirer causes or procures to be sold or let on line or let on hire for such in a factory any machinery driven by power which does not comply with the provision of subsection 1 shall be punishable with imprisonment for a term which may extend to three months or with fine which may extend to 500 rupees or with both. Subsection 3 The provincial government may make rules specifying further safeguards to be provided in respect of any other dangerous part of any particular machine or class or description of machines. Section 32 Prohibition of employment of women and children near cotton openers Prohibition ka kya matlab hai? It means banned by law. No woman or child shall be employed in any part of a factory for pressing cotton in which a cotton opener is at work. Provided that if the feed end of a cotton opener is in a room separated from the delivery end by a partition extending to the roof or to such height as the inspector may in any particular case specify in writing women and children may be employed on the side of the partition where the feed end is situated. Section. 33. Cranes and other lifting machinery. Subsection 1. The following provisions shall apply in respect of cranes and all other lifting machinery other than hoists and lifts in any factory. Every part thereof, including the working gear, whether fixed or movable, Ropes and chains and anchoring and fixing appliances shall be of good construction, sound material and adequate strength, properly maintained, thoroughly examined by a competent person at least once in every period of 12 months and a register shall be kept containing the prescribed particulars of every such examination, my dear students. No, no such machinery shall be loaded beyond the safe working load which shall be plainly marked thereon. Hope you have understood this topic. Thank you very much indeed.